hello guys welcome back to my channel and I know there was not an upload for few days but that was due to work and my driving school by the way life update I have started to drive on the road and in Tuesday that was my first day of driving on the road it was pretty scary but pretty fun tomorrow I have driving lesson again and we will probably do video tomorrow because I will have time for it but now we're here because of the new car and no this is not the Lotus we have on the screen it's the new lowrider and I've been dying to try this thing so it's orange it's clearly lowrider and it's Chevrolet Impala Naranja Edition so yes let's see can we customize this beautiful car? Right at the start, we can see there is only orange color and there is only one rim choice available. So that would be new, I think. We have white wall tires, which is quite amazing and I like it. And I like those engravings on rims as well on, as on the front bumper. So let's buy the car. There is also a bundle. Yay, we just unlocked new hobby completed. Uh, you can buy it in a bundle. I will show you, of course, of course. Let's go here. And as you can see, here it is. It's 27. It's almost 28,000 for me because I own the car already. And I own this yellow nitrous. I do not own smoke and this uh, neon. So I do not know the price when there is a car in there included so let's just drive away and let's hear how it sounds well it's rumbling quite nicely I would say now let's hear when I rev it what does she say it's nice there is some crackles it does sound very classic but V8 Well, I love the sound when it's when it starts to go. It's quite interesting. It has that rasp, but unfortunately, that disappears. And it's quite boaty, as I can see. Look at how it handles when we are braking. It just goes forward quite a bit, which is quite nice. And the main thing we're all wondering: this is a low rider, so does it? Bopity bop and hops around. I hope it does because it wouldn't be a low rider if it doesn't. So let's check it out. Well, it doesn't go right or left. Yes, it goes up and down with front and the booty. It's quite amazing. I love it. So, wait a second. Does the lifted back end. Whoa, we're sliding quite a bit. Does the lifted back end affect its handling? Let's check this out. So we're trying to go. It has some wheel spin, but not too much. Let's lift the back end. And no, no, I didn't want to press that. And let's check now. Yes, it will spins hell of a lot more. Now let's check it in the corner. Let's do a bit of testing before we customize it so yeah it's it's boaty it's heavy it's classic and it's, of course as you would expect it's quite fast for a stock car so yeah we are sliding a bit but nothing too crazy it kicks out at lower speeds which is interesting but let's try to turn with our back lifted whoa well you see, it will spin when we lift the back end. Let's try to turn again with back lifted. Let's see how it handles. Whoa! Yeah, it slides quite a bit. Let's see how will it turn with the front lifted. Very, very slowly. Almost nothing. Can we turn this over? Can we flip it over? No, we cannot. So if you want to drift, you just slam the back end upwards and it's 
Sorted. You're drifting as hell. Hell yeah. Never mind. Let's see. Does this thing have any customization? We'll hop in the menu. Customize. Oh, I knew it. Well, it's quite a unique car, so I was expecting this. I cannot say I haven't. So let's see at least liveries. Well, that's quite nice because it's blacked out. It's quite good. I love it. Why? Never mind. <laughs> let's go on. This is quite nice. These are very nice designs. And this is the Summit version, if I'm not mistaken. This is beige. I'm not wrong. You could correct me in the comment section. This is Coca-Cola one. It looks amazing. I actually love it. It reminds me of Cuba. Cuba? Cuba? This is rich. It's gold plated. This is simple purple with white roof. I quite like those designs. Oh, this is also nice. And this... This is even better. But I think I'm gonna stick to... Oh, some flames. Yes, flames could be good on these cars. Very nice. Uh, I think I'm gonna stick to original design because it's quite nice as well. So let's see what can we change. Do we want to change the tires and put tire text? No, for once we have a white wall in the game and I would like to keep it. Oh, look, I unlocked the box shaped smoke. Very nice. Uh, do we have something? We'll put this nitrous and underglow. Well, let's put the red one because it could fit with the orange. Because it's the warm color. So, and it's the only neon I have. Well, actually, no. Let's slap on the collector one. This is perfectly fitting for this car. And let's. This was quick customization, isn't it? Yes, because we didn't customize anything. Haha. Uh -huh. I'm kind of disappointed, but I kinda get it, because this is a unique car, as it is, so... But we could make it a bit more crazy. Maybe we could put, uh, let's say, some uh, duck spoiler, duck wing at the back, and I don't know, maybe some uh, bigger antennas, or... Some adjustment to the front bumper, or side skirts, or a bit of carbon, or... Look! It has no wing mirrors. I only noticed. So yes, it is what it is. We'll test it out. I'm not sure how are we gonna test it, because there is no event, unfortunately. <laughs> you cannot see my um, neon because of the ride height. But if you lift the booty, you can see it beautifully. Wait, so... Now the inscription lowrider at the back. Wait, not wait. Now it's red, and before it was orange. Why? Am I just imagining stuff? No. Should it change color? So when you're s stopping, it's red, and when you're pressing the brake, it's orange. I have no idea. I would like an option to raise my car completely, like front and back part. What? Oh yeah, so... Does it light up when you press the brake? I believe yes, and at, the, at night it's, it's glowing on its own. Never mind. So let's test this thing. Oh, it's quite amazing. I love to do that. I'm sorry I'm gonna do that all the video so it's quite fast it's boaty it's heavy you can feel it it's classic it's uh, huge it's humongous look at it it's long very long and i like it and i think you should buy this car because it's quite good and it's quite amazing and it's beautiful it's nice adding to your collection i mean of course it's not racing legend and it's not fast as i don't know something in Ferrari range or something like that, but it's quite good. Turning and braking, oh my god, you need to brake so much earlier. And yes, it's boaty, but it's quite a fun to drive. We should test it. I don't know. I saw in the video they were doing some skids. 
with front and lifted so I'm wondering can I do that yes let's do it yes we can turn it around oh this is amazing yeah that's appropriate now because we do have one raging bull here it's out of control it's smoking it's amazing and uh, it's even easier to do donuts with uh, back and lifted oh yes look at it it's quite amazing I love it so I think we should drive around like this and maybe do one event what are you doing in the middle of the road never mind I should have beeped there so let's do one short event with this car and let's see how it compares to the other ones in the class just because I'm curious what shall we do let's not do the same events all the time let's jump in let's do the accident why the hell not because that's interesting event it's not like all the others we need to transport the guy to the hospital and it's perfect because we have a low rider why is it perfect I have no idea I just it's perfect because he will have a nice comfortable ride that's why it's perfect I'll listen to it Oh, it sounds so meaty. Very nice. Yes, let's raise it up. And come to the start line as a king. And let's see how this thing handles in the race. There is seriously no wing mirrors. It's amazing. I love it. It's slow starting as you can see. They just flew away. And I'm at the back. Slowly making my way Nowhere well one position gained. It's pretty hard to control It's holy Jesus. It's turning circle. It's like a boat and Not that tiny boat big ass meaty cruiser one Yes, oh my god. Oh my god. Come on. Come on. It's slipping and sliding and going everywhere Come on it's pretty heavy you can clearly see this is a long heavy car that slides all around all all over the place how convenient he crashed in a hot rod and now he's gonna find Whoa, himself in that looks bad even from here low rider we need to help. yes we need to help come on oh, drag man. him to our car there might be internal injuries. like I said I we'll would like you gotta get into the hospital fast. This is what we do, you hear? We take care of our own. Okay, so now, oh my god, I slept. Oh Easy. my god. You almost, almost, almost. But you don't want to get into the Jesus, hospital it's sliding as hell. Maybe because the uh, road is wet. It was raining a few minutes ago. But yeah, like I said, I would like for Ivory Tower to include some events. Yes. Events. Yes. Um, According to this car, how could I say that? I would like them to do some events where we can use the hydraulics and we can use... What the... I haven't pressed that... Did the car just raise it, itself when we were going downhill? I believe it did. Oh, come on. Move out of the way. We're ambulance now. I believe it's raising itself when you're going on the slopes, which is quite interesting. So yeah, I was saying about events. I would like some events where you can use the hydraulics and where you can use your lowriders. In the way they should be used. Well, we didn't make it because the car is slow. I will blame the car, not my bad driving skills. He died. Y you were probably asking what happened to him. He's dead now. But never mind, this car is cool. 
it might be slow but is there any cooler car in this game than this one look at it it's bouncing up and down and up and down and up and down I can do this all day I uh, it's missed opportunity for them not to include the the right and left movement but it is what it is and uh, I hope they do not miss out on events I would like to see events for lowriders and dancing like uh, in San Andreas where you put music and you have to do moves next to the beat that would be quite amazing and some dude just approached me and is gone well I thought he was gonna pull out his lowrider so there would be two never mind so this is the end that's all we have time for for now but we'll be back quite fast thank you guys for watching thank you guys that came all the way to the end it means a lot I appreciate it if you want to see more subscribe click that notification bell so you get notified every time I do something new and I publish a video like this video if you enjoyed it share it comment leave some feedback tell your friends and we'll see you in the next video where we explore something else and something more until then I will do some donuts and have some fun with this car see you guys in the next video bye